Our work, we believe, is very, very relevant to the DOD's need, both short-term and providing them at the same time with the long-term capability in the area of sensor technology, uh, high density data storage by reducing pixels uh, in their surveillance and tracking and optical communications. Plasmonics uh, which deal with metallic nanostructures, uh, for example gold, which are in the size range of 100 nanometers or less, more typically 30 to 50 nanometers, they can provide as a building block for metamaterials. We have taken a new approach to develop metamaterials which is different from traditional physicist approach and this utilizes chiral approach where a structure chiral that means it has two forms which are mirror image of each other can be utilized to to uh, develop a new generation of metamaterials where light can be bent in opposite direction to what is in the bulk. What makes our research very unique is this really truly multidisciplinary integration where we can start from multi-scale modeling to guide the materials development. We explore new physics which could be utilized for development of metamaterials with unique properties. We use chemical processing on uh, nanoscale as well as bulk level uh, to incorporate uh, interaction that will manifest uh, in enhancing metamaterials properties and at the same time keeping some applications in perspective. This kind of systematic um, integrated approach involving uh, theory in chemistry, physics, engineering is very important for development of a meaningful and effective technology. Learn more about U.S. Air Force funded projects by visiting our websites www.afrl.af.mil and www.afosr.af.mil. Like us on Facebook, watch us on YouTube, or follow us on Twitter.